right, all right, guys. I'm about to check my air fryer and just see what's going on inside. Uh oh. Let's check this jerk chicken out and see how it looks. If I can get my mitt, mitt on. Let's see. Ha! Ah, that looks good. Look real good. We'll take that out and sit it right there. You know, I think I'm going to let this maybe go for a little bit longer because I like for it to be nice and brown. So I'm going to let that go a little bit longer. Let me check on my ribs down here. It's on the bottom rack. Okay, y'all see that? I think I'm going to brown those a little bit and I'm going to get back with you guys. Okay, guys, as you see, I got one minute left. So let's see what's going on with these ribs in the air fryer. Let's check it out, y'all. Ooh, ooh, that looks good, guys. What y'all say? I think I can just take these on out and cut this video off. So we're going to take them out and set them over here with the chicken and I'll let you guys see the end result. Hello guys, welcome back to Sea Witch World. Welcome back. You guys know what time it is. Time to eat. Craig's going to say the blessing and then we're going to get ready to eat. All right, let us pray. My holy and wife, God, Father, we thank you for this food. We ask that it be nourishment and strength for our bodies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I'm hey. hungry. Hey, guys, guess what we got today? We have some jerk chicken wings. And, and jerk ribs. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yes. And, and go ahead. And we also have some devil egg and devil egg. And we cooked them in the air fryer. So we got jerk chicken and ribs in the air fryer. Guys, we also have coleslaw as well to go with that. And we about to chow down because I'm hungry. And you know I got my pickles. Y'all know I got my spicy pickles and my soda. All right, guys. We're All not right. going to talk too much longer because we're going to eat. But we do want you to know that we cook all of this in the air fryer. And it's keto. And this is keto. We're back on keto, y'all. This is all keto. So we're getting you guys prepared because next week we're gonna do a challenge with you guys. If anybody wanna um, join the challenge, hit me up. We're gonna do strictly keto. So you guys watch us this week and you'll see some of the things that we're eating that'll give you an idea of what you can eat and you can prepare yourself for next week to go strict keto. Yeah, I'm getting ready to eat, y'all. Get this. I'm gonna start off with this jerk wing here. Man, I got a rib. You got a nice rib right here. A brown, crispy brown rib. Hmm. I can taste that spice too. The jerk. Mm hmm. Mm. Good. Got my pickle, y'all. Wing is good. I'm telling y'all, this air fryer is the best thing going right now. Double it. Oh, 
I hope everybody had a great day today. I did. I had a busy, productive day. Oh, I worked today. Yep. Had to go to work. I right, do what you gotta do. Yes, sir. She wants to. Okay. That's very delicious. <laughs> you better say <sit> that. <laughs> yeah, I know better. Thirty something of you. Well, it tastes good. It do taste good, though. I will tell you if it didn't. And he would, guys. He really would. He'd be like, you know, you need to make some more moves on this. But, yeah. I think it tastes pretty good myself. Look at that red, y'all. Look at that bone. I don't know. that bone. Oh, Kiko. Give me another rip. I'm going in on these ribs. They feel good. Our last video that you know, we made with our granddaughter, she really, she really enjoyed herself. She had fun. And I also had they fun. They both had fun. Yes, in the yeah, video. Yeah, I heard they had fun. I was a little bit hyped. You know, a just, little bit. <laughs> just enjoying the company of my granddaughter. No, I didn't earlier, get a lot of hype. Earlier that day, I visited my, um, I saw my great niece and my great nephew. And then I saw my younger grandchildren. Then I saw my older grandchild. And then another baby grandchild. So, guys, I was really hyped. They know. Y'all can see that she was hype. But my granddaughter is looking forward to coming back to make another video. Yeah, we gotta get it back. She likes the seafood warriors though. And she can eat too. <laughs> Ooh, she was I knew y'all saw that. She don't mess around. Well, that that's... big is nothing. <laughs> that big is nothing. It's normally how it is. Little people can eat a lot. I don't gain weight. I do need to try um chicken. I'm killing the um Killing the real mm, chicken, y'all. Nice and crispy and jerky. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. In the air fryer. Put them in there. Let them go. 30 minutes. Dinner is ready. And it's always good to kind of prepare your meat either the day before or earlier. And I put them in like a freezer bag with the seasoning and everything on it. So when I get home and get ready to cook, I just pop my freezer bag out the refrigerator, lay them on that rack, slide them in. Hook up 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, I switch the racks up. 15 more minutes, and dinner is served. Hey, couldn't get much easier. Yup. I think I want a rib. Did you take the demonstration on that? Um... I did. I, I, I take the um, air fry demonstration. Mm -hmm. We're going to start that in there. But a couple of people was like, you really didn't know how to use your air fryer. 
the good thing about it is our air fryer, we have an air fryer oven. And it's a little bit different from a lot of people's air fryer. I've never used it like egg like one. If you drop it in. I've never used that kind before. I've already had the oven with the three shells. The power air fryer. So I'm speaking from my experience with the power air fryer. This real is good y'all. Look, look at the crisp on it. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> look like it come off the grill outside. And it tastes good and juicy. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah. Right off the bone. This thing is good. Get another rib, y'all. Another rib? Mm hmm. We're working on them ribs for a while. I know. <clears throat> they good. You mm don't -hmm. get jerk ribs all the time. Mm. Is this some kind of sauce you use? The jerk sauce? It might be your idea. I did. Some of my ribs, I put the jerk on it. And some of my ribs, I didn't put the jerk on. So, you'll figure out which ones I did and which ones I did. I can taste. So, like Pam was saying, um, I think she said yesterday, you don't need to junk food up in your house. You get rid of it. So next week, right? Is it next week? Mm -hmm. So next week, we're going to start working with people with the keto. Uh, we're doing it right now, so. And if you want to kickstart, you can come on, kick started with us. What you do is get some protein, some kind of meat. And some vegetables, some kind of green. We got coleslaw. That's our greens tonight. Coleslaw go good with barbecue, like ribs and stuff. An egg, a lot of protein. Mm hmm. And you can do cucumbers. Uh, cucumbers. I'm talking about food right now. Cucumbers and tomato, peppers. All that stuff you can do while you eat, especially ribs and barbecue type stuff. I think I'm gonna go for the rib too. <laughs> I mean, the jerk chicken is great, oh, yeah, and I'm, I'm going good. back but there. The rib, but right now, the I'm going for the rib. Mm -hmm. I'm shocked to see how juicy they are. I ran it over some pat hand behind it so you see how juicy they are. Do another egg. These eggs are good. Double eggs is a good added addition. If you like eggs to your meal. Throw it down today, babe. You throw it down. Mm-hmm. 
I'm going to do it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going for another egg. I'm working on my stacked bones over here. And it's like. Looking like a graveyard. Dry bones. <laughs> they ain't dry. Mm -hmm. Definitely ain't dry. And I should have got my jalapenos because you can get, eat your jalapenos, give you another little kick up, you know, a little spice up. Mm -hmm. Oh, that sounds good. I like a little added stuff like that, like jalapenos. There's no carbohydrates to it. Pickles, no carbohydrates. And it adds a nice little season to your food. And you're not losing taste. Mm -hmm. Nigga, the jerk sauce. First time when I used it a while back, about a year ago, I didn't read the directions. I just slapped it on there. Ha ha ha! Oh yeah, I remember that. Mm, mm, mm. I remember that. It was too much, so <clears throat> be careful. You only need a small amount. Read the direction, mm -hmm. because I'm telling you. Mm. It will burn your mouth, it will light you on fire. Oh yeah, you barely can eat them, unless you really like really, really hot. Spicy stuff. Need a little bit more coleslaw. Those coleslaw are good. When you eat like this, you won't even miss the bread. Mm -mm. Do you? Nope. And you get full. Of protein. And protein is going to sustain you longer than carbohydrates. Oh, yeah. Carbohydrates, you eat them and you'll be hungry again in about 30 minutes. Yep. But this protein will hold you all I night. Oh, and see, we, we, even though we're doing keto, right, this week, we're doing keto OMAD, so. One meal a day. We just got a whole list of tomorrow about this time. One meal. And you can, like, fix this up. You can have onions, put onions on top of it, green peppers. You can have all that little stuff in there if you want to. A nice tall salad. Yep. Be creative. Don't just be blamed. Tomatoes. Yeah, make it, you know. I'm trying to really get it together so we can have something for you guys to, to see good, really good. Well, this is good. I wish you could taste it. It's so I'm, good. I'm going for chicken wings. Mm -hmm. I want one that's nice and brown. Yeah, like this one. Mm -hmm. Oh okay. yeah, it looks good. Yes. The jerk teasing on it. Mm. Oh yeah. Good. This is good. This is extremely good. Mm. Feel the itis, y'all. <laughs> but I did get up early this morning. 
Mm. I feel the item. Hmm. You don't know I gotta get all this meat off the bone. You haven't got all the meat off the bone. Me and you. Mm-hmm. Look at this bone. Look, the real bone ain't got, you still got meat on the real bone. Where? Right there. And Where? That's just you hard. You got a whole chicken wing right there. I'm not, I'm not finished eating that. Oh. This, I can't get no more meat off this. Mm-hmm. Okay. This is done with the chicken I haven't finished it. You had to work that plate and stop I did. Around. You, you eat crow. Look at that wing right there sticking out. Mm -hmm. The wing got meat on it. Right here? Yeah. You worry about Just my plate. And what about your own plate? You remember you didn't eat the wing tip. And you gonna leave that wing tip on the plate. You just not eat the wing tip. That's good. I don't know. They're good as long as they got they cleaned off good. Some places don't clean them good. <laughs> eating mm -hmm. I don't eat them. But I like the wing tip. They're crispy. You know, I can feel a lot of flavor in this Crispy and crunchy. Mm-hmm. In some places, they cut the whole wing off. They don't even serve the wing. You cut the whole tip off. Well, the tip, yeah. They cut the whole wing tip off. Mm-hmm. They messing up. <laughs> I don't know. The girl ain't got to clean them fellas off. <laughs> Cause that's where most of the fellas be. They better not let you see cut it all. No, I want my wings cut. Because look, one time we went to a um, Japanese restaurant. Hibachi. We were sitting there and a the guy was just cooking. He had Craig's steak, right? Cooking the steak. He cut the fat off. Craig is like, ah, Don't cut the fat off my steak. No, that's the seasoning. That no. A little bit of fat. And the guy said, you want that? The crib was like, yeah, I want that. Leave my fat on my steak. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's really embarrassing. Well, he even cut my steak down. Mm -hmm. Cutting all the fat off, trying to throw it away. Embarrassing. You can't take him nowhere. The devil is a liar. You can give me all my steak. I pay for all of that. <laughs> the fat and all. The <laughs> fat and all of it. So I leave that jig on the grill, let it crisp up, let that fat crisp up a little bit. Ooh, yeah. Take him nowhere. Mm -hmm. I paid for all of it. Don't throw that away. That was that was just the flavor. <laughs> I know that's right. <laughs> Give me my steak. Mm-hmm. And you want a steak like this? End up with a steak like this. Mm. Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> stop eating before me. <laughs> I got throw down while you was talking. <laughs> I was going down. They saw me. I go in. I don't be playing around. I don't be playing around. We're going to get ready to say goodbye. Yeah, I think it's time. We're going to okay. just ready to say goodbye. All right, y'all. We're going to see y'all later. Peace out. Peace don't out. Don't forget to subscribe and like. And if you have any comments, please leave them. Tell us whether or not you enjoy us eating. And guys, be blessed. Be blessed.